Shamara sister. Bitch, you paid to go look like Shamara. You look a damn fool. <laughs>
Y'all hoes think y'all gonna think y'all gonna let a come in and host some sh Y'all got me mother I don't even fuck like that. I don't even fuck like that. I'm not jacking that at all. I'm not jacking that shit at all. I'm cool with George and I'm cool with Isaiah, but all that fake ass like that, but I don't do that. I put blood, sweat, and tears into this for this other have a way to even be on any type of shows. These got me really not being on on dollhouse, bro. They got me up. How? 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 How come in and be a host of something that me and Isaiah y'all host think y'all gonna think y'all gonna let a come in and host some Y'all got me mother I don't even fuck like that. I don't even fuck like that. Me and Isaiah been talking about that's that it's no loyalty with them. So when I go on and do bigger things, I'm not, I'm never, I'm never, I'm never, never going to be on those shows with none of them. Y'all crazy as Y'all crazy as Congratulations. I will not be on there. How did I, how I make relevant come and try to host a show? I got me up. Y'all got me up. That's the that's, that's, that's. Here's the thing. I do agree with Kenzie being mad because she has the right to feel that way. But do I think Kenzie should host it over Joyce? I don't think neither of them should host. I feel like this to be a bigger celebrity figure. I just feel like they, to me, don't, don't have what it, like, I wouldn't even say what it takes. But, like, the name to be a host for the cast members not to disrespect them. Y'all know what I'm saying? Like, if Kizzy were to be a host, the girls would try to fight her. If Joyce were to be the host, which she is, I'm guessing, they're going to try to fight her. So it's like, we need somebody that the cast members are going to have a certain level of respect. That's all I was saying. Like, it's Madison, even though we know she wouldn't do it. But somebody like her. Y'all get what I'm saying? So that's just how I feel about it. And how much times we're going to keep talking about this show before it ever gets filmed? I mean, goddamn. We've been supposed to see the show. Now, if y'all want to show with T-Girls, check out... Let me stop. <laughs> no, let me keep going, though. Check out the Girls Club on Tronics, and also check out The Dolls with Gemini Films. The Dolls was really good. I will say that. I know this is way off topic, but it still kind of has to do with the situation. The Dolls show on YouTube was really, really good. The storylines were funny. The girls were likable. They didn't just thump. Like, they had... They, were, they talked about other stuff. We saw a whole T girl with a with a kid who was very like she was masculine. I was like, oh, you feel me? Like she was from Bigo. Like <laughs> it was good. Like that's the type of reality show I like to see. It had depth to it. They wasn't just thumping. Okay. Now another T girl that's not too excited about just being a host is Sway. Persuade said, no, I will not be doing dollhouse. Y'all heard what Kenzie said. Uh, ain't no B that came after me for the host me, no shade, no T. Congratulations and congratulations to the dolls that do make the show. I'll be supporting always. But no, I will not be doing it no more. No one is hosting me. The way y'all be talking about hosting, it's giving jacked. Like, y'all talking about hosting. Bitch, you're not gonna host me. Do you host, host, host? Okay? Here's the thing with Sway, though. Like, compared to Joyce, she would have more of a right to host and be a host and you be under her. Because we've only seen Persuasion about like a couple of times. And one time she was used as like a guard dog to attack Kenzie. So she can't really say too much. Now Joyce Touch Me Benny had a whole lot to say through some shade at the, every, at the whole situation with the girls being so mad. I'm really the fabulous host. Like I'm not even going to really even respond to Shorty because it's really pointless if you really think about it. Look at her and look at me. Look where she I really hate the fact that Joyce touched her nose because her nose was fine. Like you're you're supposed to touch me, baby. You wasn't supposed to touch your nose. You know what I'm saying? Like, why did you touch your nose? It was fine. Uh, I hate that. Where she at? And look where I'm at. Like, Let's be real. 
Cause crazy, you could never, you could never be a hoe. You can't even like, mm, babe. You can't even get casted for a regular show. You went on Cambria um, platform. So you went on Cambria platform acting like me. Now all of a sudden all the girls want to have inside. I make trends for this. Guess I like, let's be real. One thing about Joyce, she is see you next Tuesday. She really is. Like, <laughs> you can't deny it. Let's be real. Persuasion. Now, Persuasion said next time you, you never her, she going to end up popping Joyce. That's not even a fair fight, Persuasion. Like, come on now. You know you're going to end up having uh, Joyce's nose looking like damn Thriller off of Michael Jackson. Like, come on. Come on. I just don't feel like Persuasion has any right to be mad because, like, I don't feel like she's putting in the work. When it comes to being on these shows and stuff like that, that's what I think. Okay, all right. Uh, next thing I wanted to get Bring up Miami. Okay, so previously known as Side Chicks Miami. Now this show to me was funny. I like it. Um, I think it has its particular parts. I will be dropping my reaction to it soon, so stay tuned for that. Make sure you guys go over there to Twitch and make sure y'all go and subscribe and follow so you guys can see my reaction to the show. Now, the show in itself. I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. The reason why it's missing two is because we didn't get a huge intro of the girls before they actually got to commingle. But besides that, she liked it. Nicole, you thought this was Black Ink Crew, Luki, but it is not Black Ink Crew. And the way she says Barb, it sounds like a parrot. Polly want to call her Barb. What do you mean, Barb? Barb. I mean, Barb. She sounds like a parrot. I'm like, where are the Fruit Loops? Like, <laughs> my job. I'm going to talk about this on the, re uh, the reaction, but I met Nicole before. I used to do, like, extra work for, like, Love & Hip Hop Miami and, like, Black and Cartel Crew. Uh, so I've been in, in their shows, uh, not in their shows, but, like, background in, in uh, Cartel Crew and stuff. She is nice in person. And her surgery greets you before she does because her butt enters the room first, right? But she is nice and stuff in person. And she is pretty. Surgery and all, she is very pretty in person. I felt like she was looking for a problem with Selena. And I think that she thought that they were going to edit her. She's used to VH1 editing. So I feel like she thought they were going to edit her into like a certain way and make Selena look like a whore. But the thing is, Selena has always stated she's a whore. So it, it, it didn't do big of a difference. So it just kind of made her look like a whack job. You get what I'm saying? But the show in itself was actually hilarious. Now, when it comes to Shador, Shador, it felt like she walked into the wrong show. <laughs> I'm not talking about looks, so don't even turn this by the color thing, because I think Shador is pretty. But it felt like she came in there on some sausage or baddies type of mood, and the girls was on, uh, what's that? Wags. There was a show called Wives and Girlfriends. It was giving Wags and Girlfriends. She was giving sausage or baddies. OK, it just it, it felt off. I was like, oh, some don't fit with it. Something's not quite like the other. And it was should have worked. OK, I felt like she was trying to insert herself into the drama between the Selena and Nicole thing. And it, it kind of was like out of nowhere. Uh, but Nicole, you drank too much that first episode, clearly, because you were slaying your What do you mean, babe? I don't even have the issue with you, babe. Not babe. Like a damn parrot. Um, Kept chirping away at Selena, but he never clearly stated what was the issue. And Tina King, where you come from, bitch? <laughs> Tina King thought we just all forgot about the myth. Tina King said, y'all going to erase the myth out y'all memory. I don't care what y'all say. I wasn't on the myth. Tina King, we going to try to forget that you were ever on the myth. Sure. <laughs> now, she didn't look pretty, but... Once again, inserted herself as a drama that had nothing to do with her. It just didn't make any sense at all. Okay? The show in itself, like I say, 8 out of 10 for sure. I could see the show getting a lot better. I cannot wait till Bianca comes along because her and Selena cannot stand each other. Okay? One last thing I want to get into, guys, is Sasha Dramatic Season 5. It looks like the girls are sort of teasing Sasha Dramatic Season 5 and them coming back. Uh, now, Cash says that she can't wait to see Miss Fly Nye on Sasha Jabati season five. 
And Fly Nye basically replied back that she's ready, she's ready for Buki, but she said, been waiting for that since season four, boo. Get up with me. Mm. Who is going to take the W in the squabble? I think Cash. Cash is faster than, than Fly Nye. Fly Nye, you can't get fly with Cash. Sorry. Ugh. Anybody says different, you're a hater. Like Cash or not, she's very swift with dance. Fly Nye, not that quick. And y'all know Cash gets on demon time in regards to Sausage Trebatties. I'm just saying. I don't think it's going to end up too well for, for Fly Nye. And I don't think she's ready for Cash. Okay? Who y'all think going to take the W in the comments? I want to see what y'all think. Also, Isaiah kind of teased like the two that the two girls are coming back to the show. I don't agree with this at all. Why make the show Dollhouse if you're just gonna bring back the two girls for Sauce with your baddies? It just it, it doesn't make any sense to me. And all it is is gonna just create that same debate that we've seen all of Not as TV existence with two girls fighting cis girls. And I'm sick of seeing that debate. It's very annoying, it's tiring. I'm sick of seeing it. So why bring them back? And they already have and Joyce and them already have their own show. Like I just I just don't get the point in doing that. Because it's like we're going to be watching the same show over and over again. And it's like, ugh. Ugh. Joyce said, I'm so ready to get another hoe in the pool. It's such a bad season five. Even Barbie said she's trying to pull up. Pull up, pull up. Tell that bitch to pull up. Now, season five, we're going to need Barbie's song as the intro, though. That's what I think. I don't think they should be on there, though. Okay? Leave your comments down below. Let me know what y'all think. And we're all babies. Ain't no personal thing. All that thing.